Hey guys, welcome back to the Parkiverse. This week, joining our collection of Android home screen setups is one for you fans of the darker side of anime. So if you like Tokyo Ghoul, Berserk or even the classic Devilman, this one is just for you. With a request score of over 11,000, I bring you a setup for Chainsaw Man. Just like the rest in the series, I'm going to show you exactly how you can take your boring Android home screens and turn them into something like this. So if you want to see more like this, as well as other Android tips and tricks, make sure to like and subscribe. Oh and don't forget to get your favorite images animated, make sure to submit them right within the Epic Live Wallpaper app itself. And of course, don't forget to boost them right to the top with the number one ranking request made on a weekly basis, so don't miss out. So here they are, with Maki Ma in charge, Chainsaw Man ready to pounce. And this one is definitely a darker home screen setup, which is going to be perfect for those of you with AMOLED devices, truly allowing you to show off the full dynamic range of your Android screens. Oh and as for the live wallpaper itself, I've made sure to animate with a ton of fine detail which I know that you guys will appreciate. So on the topic of the live wallpaper, how about a quick game of Spot the Difference? If you can spot up to 5 different animations that I've added in, you'll be able to grab yourselves some free gems to use right within the epic live wallpaper app itself in order to help boost up all of your requests. Just comment down below all of the ones that you can find and you can grab yourselves up to 100 free gems. So now let's move on to the home screen setup itself. Here I've gone for a boxed out theme across the whole look. So with the app icons I've gone for red transparent boxes and as for the widgets themselves I've gone for rectangular shapes. So at the bottom of our screen, we have a bold music indicator as well as music controls. And matching right at the top, we have a date and time indicator. To replicate this home screen on your Android phones, all you're going to need is Nova Launcher, KWGT for all of the widgets, and finishing things off as icing on the cake, we're using Hex Installer. Now don't worry, I'll leave a link for everything that you'll need down in the video description below. But before we get started, make sure to smash that like button, it will really help out the channel. So let's kick things off with some Nova Launcher tweaks. Starting with removing that notification bar from our home screens to give us this clean look. For this, within Nova Launcher settings, just simply head into the look and feel section and under notifications, make sure to disable this option right here. So now that we have that out the way, let's make a couple more changes within Nova Launcher to get this comfy icon set up. So just head into the home screen section and starting right at the top with the desktop grid, we want to set that to 5 across and 11 down. After which, for the icons themselves, we're first going to turn off their labeling and then decrease their size. Now, as for our home screen dock itself, make sure to head into it and disable it. So now that we have the basic setup, let's move on to our home screen app icon. Giving us these squared off blood red icons is the Midnight Club Pack. 
just simply head to Nova Launcher's look and feel section and then set the pack as your system icons, just as I'm showing here. Now, before we go any further, let's grab ourselves this awesome live wallpaper. For this, just simply head over to my custom collection app, Epic Live Wallpapers, and you'll find it there. And remember, if you want me to animate one of your favorite images, make sure to submit it right within the app itself. And of course, don't forget to boost it higher up the list. And every week, I'll be making the number one rank request. Now, it's time for the KWGT widgets. So, let's start things off right at the bottom of our screen, with this music indicator, as well as media controls. Straight from the OSHA pack is the widget Music Fonts. Just simply start by loading in a KWGT layout to your home screen and then you want to resize it so it looks something like this. Now here, to match my look, make sure to also long press it and toggle the padding option. Now with this widget within KWGT, all we're going to do is simply adjust the widget size. Now to do this, just simply head over to the layer tab and adjust the scale option. Here, for my screen size, I'm only going to make a slight adjustment to 94.5. And of course, goes without saying, make sure to hit save before you leave. Now for the second widget of the setup, this boxed out date and time indicator. Straight from the outline pack is widget W39. So here, let's start things off once again by loading in a KWGT layout to our home screens and then resize it to match my look. And exactly the same as we did before, make sure to long press it and toggle the padding option. Now for this widget, within KWGT, we're going to do exactly the same as we did for the first one. Just simply head over to the layer tab and adjust its scale so it's no longer hanging off the edges of the canvas. And that's it, the widgets were as simple as that. And now wrapping up the setup, we're using Hex Installer. This is going to give you a nice AMOLED friendly black backdrop with the colors of the theme splashed across your whole system, including the notification panel. Just use the color codes that I'm showing on screen. Or alternatively, you can get a similar result using the app OneShade. Now if you like this video and want to see more just like this, make sure to hit that like button as well as subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on the next one. And as for your live wallpaper requests, make sure to boost them right within the epic live wallpaper app itself. See you guys next time on Into the Parkiverse.